Hi, I'm Karen Biko. I'm an abstract artist here in Calgary. I was awarded the opportunity to, to paint this beautiful horse. Uh, it's part of a fundraiser for um, many of the charities here in Calgary. What has happened is Spruce Meadows has created these horses and selected 20 charities that bid for these horses. And the one charity that this horse represents is the Calgary Health Trust. Calgary Health Trust chose me because of previous work that I'd done with them recently and asked me if I would be interested in painting this horse because I've always wanted, as an abstract artist, I've always wanted to be able to paint a horse. I just never expected it to be this way, but really I've had so much fun doing it. Part of the reason that we're doing this is for the Renfrew Recovery Center. So after meeting with the Renfrew Recovery Center, we really wanted to show the journey that somebody struggling out of addiction would take. And my job as an artist to, is to sort of bring that to the horse. So that's why I've chosen to go from a dark to a light theme. There's lots of motion and turbulence in this, in this piece. One of the things I really wanted to do was show, um, you know, sort of like um, sadness and uh, hurt in the sh in the horse without it being a negative message. So, really low on the horse, you'll see there's sort of drips with through the blue and stuff like that, and they look like sadness to me, and they they feel almost like pain and and suffering, and so that's overlaid with um, swirls of color as, as people are going through motion and turbulence and then then the white dots sort of come in which are happier and you know it's it's never a straight line this journey. One of the things that is a real signature of my work is the dots and uh, some people have called me the dot lady um, because I just I can't seem to stop doing them. Dots are round, they're happy, they they give energy to things and they seem to show up in most of my artwork so of course that was a big factor in, in doing this horse was, was making sure that there was a lot of my Biko dots in there and that they resonated throughout the piece. So the dot paths actually guide you know people or the eye through the journey of the horse and again like I said they're not a straight line it's you know, it meanders a little bit around the horse and there's ups and downs. When I'm working on a project like this, um, I'm always trying to think of a name or an emotion that goes with the piece that I'm working on. And this one, um, I really struggled with a name that would, would suit the piece and the struggle that, that somebody fighting addiction might go through. And so at the end of the day, the, the, the name that feels the best for me is Freedom's Journey and I I love that name because it feels like the name of a horse and it feels like it, it says the story of this horse too. I can't believe how much fun I've had with this project. I really really am, am honored to have been chosen to do this and I thank the Calgary Health Trust and Red Fruit Recovery Center for giving me this opportunity to do the horse. I'm so pleased that Spruce Meadows has put together this fundraiser and I thank them for the opportunity also.